I honestly don't believe that there's a better athletic director job in the country. Yet it's a job Trev Alberts no longer wants. The Nebraska AD resigning today and accepting the athletic director position at Texas A&M. The headline still may not compute for Husker fans. Alberts leaving his alma mater amid the university's lengthy search for a new president. Albert served as the Huskers AD for three years. He certainly left his mark, making several bold moves and pushing the athletic department forward. Albert's hiring at Texas A&M was announced just over an hour ago. 10 11's Chase Madison joins us live from Memorial Stadium. Thank you, Kevin. It is eerie out here, and it's the same climate with the Husker fan base and here at Nebraska Athletics outside of Memorial Stadium. The news coming down earlier this afternoon, as you just mentioned, and throughout my afternoon being here outside, we never saw Trev, and the staffers and the students we did see kind of gave us eyeballs looking like if we had information. The news just kind of loomed all day until a staff-wide email by Trev himself confirmed that he is headed to College Station. That is one interesting way to have an exit and definitely not resonating too well with Husker fans. Uh, but it's just overall just an eerie day and an eerie landscape for the future of Husker Athletics with their leader leaving the program. Reporting live outside of Memorial Stadium, Chase Madison, 1011 Sports. Thank you, Chase. One of Alberts' crowning achievements is volleyball's outdoor match. It set the world attendance record for a women's sporting event. It was historic, and frankly, it was a blast. Alberts admitted he had some hesitation at first, but he coordinated a day that will be remembered for years to come. This is what Alberts is walking away from. Nebraska's programs are trending upward. The football team just added the top high school quarterback in the country. The volleyball team reached the NCAA final. Both basketball teams are on the rise. Baseball, softball, whoever is the next AD, he or she will inherit a highly competitive athletic department. And you have to wonder how this will affect the status of Matt Rule. He was hired by Alberts, and when Rule was introduced, he said Nebraska's leadership is a primary reason why he took the job. However, both Ted Carter and now Alberts have left. Rule is entering his second season with the Hoskers.